We've got our first morels of the season. <laughs> yes, look at that. Let's pick it. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yes. All right, where there's one, there's more. So let's check around. Oh, yeah. I'd like to let this grow a little bit more, but people go through here so often that it's not worth leaving anything. There we go. A two for the season. I'm so happy. <laughs> Found another one. Got three. <laughs> I didn't bring a bag with me because I wasn't expecting to find any. I'm happy, I'm real happy. <laughs> and before anyone even says it, harvesting mushrooms by plucking it, cutting it, or just leaving it alone does not affect its yields year after year at all. So I happen to just pluck these because I just want more mushroom. But on occasion, I'll cut them just so that I don't waste time cleaning them. But for the most part, it doesn't really matter how you pick these. So let's clean these up and eat them. It's cutting off the dirt for now. And we're just going to toss in some water. All right, just toss them in the container. Fill it up with water. They'll float to the top like this. What I do is I just tap them to get all the dirt and sand off. All the sand settled to the bottom, you just dump this out and do it again. You can take a brush to clean out all the crevices if you want, but these are pretty clean and we're just going to cook them now. I'm actually going to dry and save this one. Slice this in half. Look at that. <laughs> ah, that looks so good. Alright, there you go. Drop some butter in also. All right, they're nice, crispy, and toasty. Look at that. Looks so good. Mmm. These are the best. <laughs> These are so good. Mmm. It has a really nutty and earthy taste to it. And it's really meaty. It's almost like eating meat. It's really good. Oh my god. <laughs> mm. If you watch all the way till now, it means you've watched almost three minutes of video. So, thank you very much. I just recently got this feature. So, I'll see you guys next time.